Before today's video begins, if you guys want to support me as a creator, Roblox has now introduced star codes. All you guys got to do is type in my name, Matrix, just before you guys purchase Robux. Thank you so much, everyone. Now let's get into the video. Yo, what's going on everybody? My name is Matrix and welcome to a brand new episode of Vehicle Tycoon. Guys, thank you all so much for the support in yesterday's episode. It was incredible to see how many of you guys gave insight and knowledge and help and just pure enjoyment out of this series. I'm really enjoying doing it myself and I think it's probably one of the coolest tycoon games that we've ever played on the channel and in the last video, as you guys can kind of see, we got a good amount of progress done. Um, of course today is all about getting more done and I think what we're gonna do is as you can see we're super close to 25,000 which means we'll be able to get the Ford Mustang GT and you guys know me and you know how much I do appreciate a nice Mustang so I think what we're gonna do today guys is uh, hop in our Volkswagen Beetle and uh, just take this thing for a bit of a spin not too too long but long enough to get us to 25,000 if you guys remember in the last episode we did a lot of driving and we grinded our way up pretty pretty quickly this this game is not too grind intensive and you know what guys I genuinely have been having a good time in this game and to see your guys' support on this is pretty freaking awesome so thank you all so much this game is still doing better than vehicle simulator is and I'm, I'm guessing it's because it's new but it's crazy to think that this game is doing better than vehicle simulator like how the heck is that possible but um, obviously it's a lot of fun, there's a lot to grind and uh, a lot to unlock and everybody appreciates a good car tycoon every now and then so obviously it's got a lot of players playing it and you know what guys I wanted to just take a moment here while we're grinding and just say thank you for all of the support on the different types of videos on the channel guys I know you enjoy car videos but if you haven't already taken a look at it check out my other content I've been playing a game called farm town and a game called Vesteria two of my favorite games on Roblox and you, if you guys could go check it out just watch it for five to ten minutes see what you think and uh, let me know okay because guys the support on those videos could definitely be increased and I'm sure as time goes on and I upload more variety uh, we'll get a lot of new viewers all over the place but if you guys haven't already checked it out I would greatly appreciate it the content there is really awesome and I do think you guys will genuinely enjoy those videos just as much as these car ones but um, anyways that's just a little bit of shameless promotion don't mind that what we're doing is getting pretty close to $25,000, which is awesome. And you know what? Since I know these videos do a lot better, I, I figured I'll talk to the majority of the tricksters right now. Guys, I will be doing vlog videos very shortly, okay? So for those of you who are big fans of vlog style content, and if you're fans of my Mustang, I will be doing a lot of content talking about why I chose a Mustang, what I love about it, what I don't like about it and uh, what it's like to own over a year of ownership. I've written down tons of ideas for videos with the Mustang and I do think you guys will really like them. I'll try to keep the vlogs really fun and entertaining and we'll do a lot more than just talk. Uh, we'll do some driving. I definitely do want to get some mods done. I already have a few done but nothing too serious. Um, if you guys didn't know, uh, my Ford Mustang is not stock. A lot of people seem to think it is, but it is definitely not stock. It's got a Cobb Access tune, so the car is tuned. It is currently pushing roughly around 340 horsepower. Guys, keep in mind it is the EcoBoost model. Um, it also has a cold air intake, a downpipe and exhaust and the tune itself. We've got some aftermarket rims to go along with it, and of course the uh, showstopper, the wrap itself. I get a lot of attention for it, and I get the most questions about that, obviously. Um, everybody seems to want to know if it's a wrap or if it's paint, and uh, how much it cost it, etc, etc. And I think that's the perfect stuff to talk about in a video. Um, actually, you know what, we're not there yet. Whoa, dude, look at this guy's car! What the heck is this? It looks like a freaking spaceship, bro. What? That is cool. Um, wait, what is he saying? What is he saying? He says hi. Uh, let me just go ahead and say hello. <laughs> All right, let's see if he wants to race. I wonder if he can catch up to me here. I feel like this car is really, really fast. Um, but whoa, okay, maybe his is faster. And just like that, we have reached $25,000. So, $25,000 now in the bank. Let's go spend it all on a sports car because that totally makes sense. 
Alrighty, we've got it guys. We've got the 2015 or sorry 2018 model year Ford Mustang in a lime green color to boot. That is a cool color. Um, this is just perfect. And we've actually got different sounds for this as well. Okay, these aren't even that bad. Wow, okay, I'm sort of impressed. I like the way that this sounds. It sounds pretty pretty muscular. I do like it. This definitely is a GT model, obviously. Um, some parts of the model could use some work. I feel like the headlights could have used a little bit more detail, but other things like the taillights and stuff work perfectly and look great. Um, but this thing, as you guys can see, is making us a lot more money. Oh, I've got some bad news. Um, for some reason, my video just completely cut off and uh, I ran out of space on my hard drive, so the video just stopped recording and uh, I missed out on a lot. I've been grinding a ton and we're, we're back and we're, we're in full motion and we've made a substantial amount of money. So unfortunately, a lot of the video cut out there, but that's fine, I guess, not a big deal. Um, we drove around in this, and if you guys can't already tell, this thing is insanely fast. Definitely faster than our Beetle. And I'm probably going to spend a good amount of money, probably all this money, on some upgrades to our dealership right now. I'm really disappointed about that happening, but you know what? We can come back from it. Uh, no problem at all. So, we bought some parked cars. We've bought a sign, which obviously we probably should have. And we'll buy another sign. Oh, this is perfect, guys. We're getting close towards the ending of the first floor, I'm guessing. Because now it's all about just buying these little things. We'll buy a front desk. And I think we get an employee with it as well. Perfect. Um, we'll buy a snack machine. Let's see what else we can get here. Let's buy a roof. We probably should use a roof. Um, we, we can get a red carpet. We could get some lights. Oh, dude, this place is coming together. Yo, okay. We bought some plants. Um, and I wonder if buying these decorations boost up our, uh, our cash flow. It doesn't seem like they do, but it doesn't really matter. We'll get everything in here, everything we can afford, all these plants, these TVs. We'll get a little area for our clients with a table and some couches. We'll get a lamp for it as well. Um, hmm. Okay, so I guess next thing up is a second floor with office and cars. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Table set, table and chairs. Okay, and that is done. From what I can tell, the first floor is basically done. We can get the Mini Cooper as well. Um, wow, guys, this is some serious progress today, dudes. Um, not enough to get us to the second floor, but I think that's a perfect cutoff point for the video. So I do want to get the Corvette as well today, so I guess I'll go back on my grind with the Mustang and uh, try to get the Corvette going because I want to be able to get uh, more money quicker with more cars available for our clients. So let's take a drive around here and uh, let's go see if we can make some more money. Alrighty dudes, lots and lots and lots and lots of time later, I have amassed a grand total of 75,000. I wanted to get enough so that we can buy the Corvette along with buying the second floor and then probably wrapping the video up there. So we've gotten enough. I do want to see how much the Corvette will get us when we start driving that. But all in all, very progressive episode of Car Tycoon. And I'm very, very looking forward to seeing what kind of cars we can get on the second floor. I feel like things are going to get a lot more expensive soon. And uh, I don't know if I'm ready for it yet, guys. I'll be honest. But let's pull up here to my dealership and uh, try to park this thing properly, I think. Ah, who cares? It's my dealership. I can park where I want. So let's go grab this Corvette. We're only 20 grand or so away from the M5, but I'm just going to go for the Corvette. Oh, so beautiful. So beautiful. And last but not least, we are going to go for the second floor. Let's take a look at this, guys. Um, we've got walls, and that is that's about it at the moment. Okay. Um, so we'll have to save up some money for next video, but I hope you guys did enjoy this episode of Car Tycoon episode number two. If you guys did enjoy it, definitely feel free to leave this video a big thumbs up. This charger is really cool as well. But anyways, thank you all so much. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, and I will see you all in the next video.